Hey guys, what's going on today? Sean should be here. Hope you guys are having a blessed day. Got another anime reaction for you guys. The Promised Neverland episode 9. Guys, three more episodes left and it's coming down to the wire. Literally, like the intensity was here and after that episode 8, it's off the screen. <laughs> I mean, guys, that last episode though, that last episode though like blew my freaking mind literally because you know we see sister crone get dealt with and i have more respect for sister crone because of just what she went through again all those kids are going through because they don't care and you know we find out that isabella and grandma are in it together because again sister um you know, Sister Crumb was trying to report this, and then we see Grandma's like, "I already know." You know, Isabella, you're, you're getting in her, you're getting in Isabella's way. I knew this, from, I've known this from the start. You know, she had, um, she has the best, um, best kids, the best offerings, pretty much, and you know, and so you're interfering, and so she's, um, then we see that big ass demon, ugh, look like Venom. He's like, Bleh. but um, ugh, and, and they, she got killed. I noticed that. I've noticed that because when Connie died, they put the plant, they put the, the black, um, sorry, the plant, the flowers in her, and then same with um Sister Crone, she got killed by got the by the flowers, and then they be um they blossom red. I'm not too sure what that is. Maybe they'll explain later down the line. But um, you know, hopefully the kids find her note and just like because again she's you know when she's trying they they have a flashback from her as a younger um, younger girl young girl. It's cool, you know, she's, she's like, hey, I hope you damn kids escape, you know, this and that, and I, I definitely feel for her, and I, ugh. And then, you know, Isabella meets up with Ray, and then, you know, he's telling, um, Isabella's like, I got rid of her, now I'm about to get rid of you, you you're in the way, you're, dis um, you're disposable, blah, blah, blah. She locks him in the room, because, you know, and she, because she already knows, she already knows everything that's going on, again, of course she does. She's not dumb, she's, and so... And I thought the kids were getting the one up on her, but she's like, ah, no, you know, you're not. No. And she already knows the whole plan, and so she locks Ray in the room. You know, Gilda and Don take are the lookout, and then we see, you know, Isabella come out, and then we see Isabella, the kids, Norman and Ray, are about to go, um, Norman and Emma, sorry, are about to go over the wall, and then they hear some, you know, steps coming there, and then they see Isabella. And then she's like, hey, enough with the formalities, you know, let's just talk real, blah, blah, blah. She's like, look, I love you guys like you're my own children, but, you know, I'm doing this because I need to, because, you know, you guys are food. And she's like, for the special someone, you guys are special. And um, for the special someone, they haven't seen, they haven't said who, maybe that demon king or the demon lord or whoever he is. And then, yeah. Then we see Emma rush at Isabella. You know, we see Ray. I mean, sorry, I keep saying Ray, guys. Norman, grab the bag. I, I swear. Just Then you hear, and you know, Emma grabs her, and then Emma's trying to reach for the tracker, and then Isabel's like, creepy-ass smile? Mm -hmm. And then she... You hear that, you're just like... I thought she broke her neck. I thought she broke her neck when she did that, but she ended up breaking her... It looked like her leg or knee. But that just sucks. Then we see um, Dawn rescue um, Ray... All three of them running towards, you know, the cries because they hear Emma screaming. And then Nor Isabel is like, you know, look, you guys don't need to struggle or, you know, this and that. Just, you know, just play along. Just live out your lives, blah, blah, blah. And Norm she's pretty much like Norman. They scheduled the set um, pickup. Norman's the next one gone. And he's pretty much speechless. Emma's in pain. Everyone else is speechless. I'm speechless. Boom. Mind blown. Literally. So guys, episode nine. I don't know what the hell's gonna happen. I really don't. I think they're just gonna recover and just they're gonna find that note. I think and hopefully it's gonna give them some big clues on how they get the f out of there because they need to. And I hope they kill Isabella, or we'll see. But uh, guys, this reaction video will be in the Google Drive in the description below and in the comments to Google Drive reaction. So check the description. I'll even put it in the comments as well for you guys. Follow me on social media: Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. Got my PSN, PSN on there as well. Guys, San Diego Comic-Con is, um, the Funko Pops, are they keep releasing the exclusives that are coming out. My mind, I'm about to go broke. Because the Pops are coming out July 19th.
And they have so many exclusive for San Diego Comic Con. It is ridiculous. Like, I think at least a lot of the major retailers, GameStop, blah, blah, blah. So many different exclusives. Like, it's ridiculous. I'm about to go broke for the month of July. So, I'll have all those pops, but I'll be broke. <laughs> but, guys, it's going to be crazy. I can't wait to show those. Um, can't wait to post those pics and show you guys again. Definitely stay tuned to my social media, Facebook, Instagram. Check those out, guys. But... Until next time, guys, I hope you guys have a great day. Sean Shibby here. Umayoa Mu Shindiru. If you can't run, you can't. If you can run, you can run, but you can't hide, bitch.